and welcome back to the channel. On this video, my friend Keith is back. How are you doing, Keith? How's it going, Mark? Good. And he's got his trusty bike right there, the Aerial Rider Grizzly. A little dirty. A little dirty, but it's been through the uh, the ringers, I guess, lately. Oh, yeah. Still going strong. Awesome. And I'll be riding this bike right here, and that's the Lyric Graffiti. And here's proof of the graffiti right there. All right, and so where are we heading on this uh, ride, Keith? Uh, I guess we'll head to Washington Square Mall. All right, so Washington Square Mall. I haven't been up there on the bike in a long time. Last time I went up there was on the uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly when I was the owner. See how it is, because I know there's a lot of construction up there, so. And it's cool out here this morning. It's like 50 degrees, right? Yeah, and well, it was extremely foggy just about 20 minutes ago. It was ago, foggy, so. but now the, we've traded the fog for the wind. But... Hopefully it should be warming up with within the next hour. So. Yeah, I hope so. As long as there's no rain, I'm happy. Yeah, no rain would be the best. Yeah. But the fog always makes it feel damp. Yeah. Especially about an hour ago, it, it really felt like that. Yep. Okay. All right. So here we go. We're really getting into fall now with the leaves changing, dropping, temperatures dropping. We've had quite a bit of rain here lately. That's why I've started to do some uh, in-studio videos. So I'm not out here rain riding in the rain quite as often I'm trying to cut back a little bit on doing that because it is kind of cold and but I'm not going to eliminate riding in the rain or riding in the cold I'm just going to do it a little bit less often and do a little bit more in studio videos So we're heading to uh, Washington Square Mall and I haven't been up there with the bike in a long time. The last time I was there with the bike was with the uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly. I don't remember riding up to the mall with the graffiti. So this will be the first time that the graffiti has gone to the mall. What's the date today, the 20th or 21st? 20th, yeah, Sunday. So we're recording this video on Sunday morning around 10 a.m. October the 20th. That's a good hill across the street there to try your bike on too. I think I've gone up that before. Yeah. With the Grizzly. You want to try to go that way? No, that's all right. We'll go this way. Okay. But I want to do that. I want to use that one for a future uh, test on the Gris, uh, Graffiti X. Okay. Some of these hills, you know, to test the uh, 
No climb. Look at that though. That's pretty steep up there. Yeah, it's straight up to Bull Mountain. Yeah, it's a dead end though. That's a steep hill right there. Yeah, it's a dead end. But I think I've gone up there before, but not for a while. See how it, yeah, how it curves there? So that makes it even more tricky. Yeah. Quite a curve there. Yeah, we'll definitely go through Bull Mountain. Look at the traffic here for a Sunday morning. Right. Kind of miss that early morning ride. Yeah, but you know, the camera definitely likes the uh, daylight better. That's one thing the bikes can do is elude the traffic. You know, the last time we came through there, that wasn't complete, remember? No, it, was, construction. it was under construction, but it's fixed now. Pretty good. It's a good way to avoid the uh, highway the there. Way. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to cut across. And, like, I guess the, the path is right there. Yeah. Okay. All right, you Boy, can there's a lot of traffic out today. Yeah, I know, I waited there. Yeah, I saw that. It was a little too uh, risky there. Building. Yeah, we could that. do that. We could do that as well, yeah.
Alright, ready? Yep. Mm, I don't know if I have, I don't think so. Pretty steep hill here. Sometimes the camera doesn't do justice for these hills. They don't look as much of a hill on the camera as you actually see them when you're here in person. We're sure losing the uh, leaves in a hurry. The leaves are dropping in a hurry, aren't they? Yeah, I know. It's in some areas the trees are already bare. I've seen. Yeah, I think I have. I like all of these kind of trails if you can find them. It beats riding on the road all the time, right? Like I, I like the trails. You feel a little safer. Oh yeah. And it's more scenic, you know, to look at. Yeah, it's like your own secret little path. Yeah, I kind of like it. Maybe we'll see a wild critter. Hello. If we would have done the 5 a.m. ride this morning, we'd be freezing. Oh, yeah. I don't think we're going to be doing that for a while. No, I think we're now going to do the uh, late morning or mid-morning or uh, maybe uh, in studio, too. If yeah. it's raining, if you want to come around and we'll mess with the studio uh, versions. All right. Let's go off to the right. I'm not sure what we're doing. I don't know, but I like it.
Have you uh, checked your air pressure lately? Okay. Have you checked your air pressure lately? Uh, about three weeks ago. I should probably do it soon, though. S since you had the flat? Yeah. Have you tr checked it anymore after that, though? No. Oh, okay. I should, though. I know the uh, the ride one up, Cafe Cruiser, definitely the wheels are getting soft. I can feel them. And I haven't checked this one, but every, you know, before I go for a ride, I always give them a little feel to see uh, how they feel. But they feel pretty good, pretty right. hard still. I'm at the button. Yeah, they get a little squiggly. Like, you, you, yeah. you can tell. I, I like my uh, tires all the way up. Do you? Like, yeah, I do now. I like it full PSI. And especially if you have a full suspension, if you don't have a full suspension like this bike, you might want the you might want it a little softer. But I like it more. I like it more hard. The tire is more solid. Yeah, I do too. Yeah. I like it because it just kind of handles a little bit better. Like, yeah. I don't like the way it handles when it's soft. It just feels like... It just rolls better or something. It feels smooth. Like, to me, yeah. it feels smooth. I know that if you don't have full suspension, you might want that extra little oomph, you know, to uh, softer. But I like it more firm. Yeah, I do too. It's like my bed mattress. I mean, I like a more firm bed. I don't like it too soft. Where you feel like you're just sinking in it, you know? And the handling's just like a little, a little bit more predictable, I guess. Yeah, so I... I, I like to have it full PSI, but... Yeah. So I keep mine right about... I think the recommend is like 36 on these tires. I I, what's yours, about 36? I think these are 30. 30? Okay. Yeah. But when you start getting down to about 25, you start feeling it. I don't know what... I don't know what the PSI is on the uh, Graffiti X, but... Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's going to be a little more. Yeah, leaves on the ground can always be, make it a little slick too. Sometimes they get so thick on the road 
Did they cover the bike lane? And you can't even see where your bike lane is exactly. You gotta guess. And that can be slick too, uh, slippery. Yeah, I think leave on top of the white line. The white lines can be very slick. White lines are not good. Yeah, especially in the rain, you gotta be really careful. Yep, even when it's not raining, they still have a little slickness to them. I definitely would be careful if you're going to go near uh, or ride around any of the lines. Be careful crossing over. Definitely slick. Nice. Oh yeah, this is this is a nice time of year for riding through yeah. here. I'd like them to uh, smooth out this uh, bike trail though. So my headlight came on in there. Yeah, I'd like to go on and off. Yeah, it was dark enough.
I know up here, there's going to be a lot of construction, so I'm not sure how the road's going to be. So I'll just be careful. Yeah. We'll ride the bike lane until we, I guess the road just looks in the lane. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. All right, we made it to the Washington Square Mall. A little bit uh, sketchy over on yeah. the uh, <laughs> with the. But, you know, it's kind of nice to have that power to get it going, just get across the intersection. Oh, I know. You, you know. Thirty miles an hour, real fast. That's why we need that extra little oomph. And people say you don't need a bike that goes that fast. Well, you don't necessarily need the speed. You want the power to yeah, get up just... to the speed to get by over that. You need a little of both. Speed and power. Yeah, just you got to cars get... coming up behind you, 45 miles an hour. I, don't, I need to get through that intersection. No, and otherwise, what were we riding? 20 miles an hour on the road, maybe, or a little more. And uh, what on the trail? 10 to 15. Yeah. You can't get going any faster than that, and you don't want to because there's too many turns. It's narrow, and you don't know who else is on the trail sharing it with you, right? Coming the other way. Yeah. Whether it be bikes, dogs, uh, people walking their dogs. All right. Well, there's the mall. And a lot of empty spots right here. I don't think the mall's really even open yet. It's probably just open. Well, yeah, it'd be open. All right, well, that's going to do it for this video. So we went, we've made it to Washington Square Mall from King City, Oregon. So we're in Washington Square Mall is Tigard, right? Tigard, yeah. 
almost Beaverton. Yeah, it's Tigers. slash. Yeah, it's kind of like right there between the. All right, well that's gonna do it for this video. Thank you very much, Keith, for joining us on this video. All right. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, just hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up, hit that notification bell. And if you want to comment on this video or any other videos that you've seen, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining Keith and I on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.